Hi guys, good evening. Welcome back once again to The Edward. I'm your host, Eddie. And in tonight's video, uh, I thought I would do a piece on a news item that came out about two or three days ago. I was waiting to do a video on this when we got our first official set photo, officially confirming that filming has or had begun, but uh, frankly, I feel like this is just as good as time as any. Last month, it was announced that the upcoming uh, highly anticipated film, Godzilla vs. Kong, that's just the title as we know it for now, that's not the official title yet, uh, will begin filming uh, this month, uh, the Start will starts filming this month in uh, Atlanta and then also in Hawaii, now apparently also in Australia. You know, it makes sense for a movie of this scale is going to be filming in several different places. But, uh, you know, at, instead of uh, waiting to do a video talking about the first day of filming or perhaps the first set photo from the production from the set of Godzilla vs. Kong. I've got something else we can talk about, and that is the news item that actor Brian Tyree Henry, uh, probably best known more recently as his role of Alfred, a.k.a. Paperboy, in the hit FX series Atlanta, which I love. It is so damn funny and so damn good, has been officially cast in the upcoming monster fight film Godzilla vs. Kong, which is very, very exciting because that means with his casting confirmation we are getting ever closer to this movie actually beginning production it means that with more casting confirmations presumably on the way the movie will begin filming shortly later this month the film's production schedule i believe is supposed to be from this october going into next february so filming wraps in february 2019 giving them more than a year of post-production and of course for a movie featuring a bunch of cgi monsters Monsters, or at least Godzilla and King Kong, of course you're going to need more than a year in post-production, uh, putting all the final touches on and making sure that they all look good and as close to reality as possible. But uh, you know what, uh, it's just, it's incredibly tremendously exciting for me that this movie is uh, if it hasn't begun filming is about to begin filming because that means we are going to be getting that much closer to seeing it on the big screen yes it's about two years away the movie is supposed to come out May 22nd 2020 but that is going to be here before we know it and after all we're getting close to the end of 2018 it's October right now October 13th 2018 and uh, before we know it it's going to be 2019 so we'll only have a year uh, to go and until we see these two finally collide on the big screen. And you know, Brian Tyree Henry is such a good actor. He, like I said, I enjoy him immensely in Atlanta. And the guy has made a real name for himself lately. I believe he has a, he appeared in that um, movie earlier this summer. I didn't see it yet, but I want to, called Hotel Artemis. And he's done tons of other film and TV projects as well. I think he was in a couple of episodes of that hit NBC series, This Is Us and uh, several other movies as well. But I am so excited that he's going to be in one of my most anticipated movies of all time, if not the number one most anticipated movie for me. Yes, I know I've made that sentiment before when I was referring to Batman v Superman, Dawn of Justice, but I honestly believe that this movie is easily going to top that in terms of it being a versus movie, because unlike the Batman v Superman movie, I have wanted to see Godzilla and King Kong on the big screen together for a very very long time I don't know how long it's been but I've always wanted to see this happen and now we are getting that much closer to seeing it become a reality so Brian Tyree Henry's casting is super awesome because that means that this movie is well underway if it hasn't begun production yet and I think he'll be joining the likes of uh, Millie Bobby Brown best known as Le Eleven from Stranger Things who will also be appearing in next year's blockbuster film Godzilla King of the Monsters and I believe her character is confirmed or soon to be confirmed for Godzilla vs. Kong. And she'll also be joined along with Brian Tyree Henry. And then the actor who plays her father in the Godzilla sequel, Kyle Chandler. And another cast member who has been confirmed uh, a short while ago was Julian Dennison, a.k.a. the kid who played Iron Fist in the recent summer comedy film Deadpool 2. And those are
those are the only casting confirmations that we have so far. But uh, with Brian Tyree Henry's adi addition now, that is very, very exciting. And I'm very much looking forward to seeing what he brings to the film. Apparently, the word is he has been cast in a, quote, significant role. I don't know if that means he'll be our male lead or if he'll be one of our main characters. But I'm very excited to see what he brings uh, to the movie. And I'm just excited for the movie overall. And I hope you guys are as well. So what are your thoughts on the Atlanta star joining Godzilla vs. Kong? Are you excited? Are you already more? Are you already pumped for this movie? Are you even more so with Brian Tyree Henry? Are you meh? Are you yay? Please feel your feel free to leave your thoughts, opinions, and your feedback down below in the comments section. I'd love to hear from everybody. Thank you so much for watching. And be sure to subscribe and stay tuned for this channel for any and all updates and coverage regarding filming updates and confirmations for Godzilla vs. Kong in theaters May 26. 2020. Have a great rest of the night, everybody. Thank you for watching. And of course, until next time, may the force be with you.